the color uh, Hey guys, or should I say konnichiwa, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing the Colourpop and Hello Kitty collection swatch video and I'm really really excited about it. This collection is super cute and I know there's so many people out there who love Hello Kitty. So yeah, this is going to be super fun whether you love Colourpop or Hello Kitty or both. So if you are interested, then keep on watching. So in this collection, we have two sets and a bunch of single products. The products that come in the sets are unfortunately not sold separately, but I think everything's just so cute. Um, I'm going to swatch everything by category. Like I'm going to do blushes together, eyeshadows together, and lip products together. I'm not going to do it based off like the sets they come in. So yeah, let's start with the blushes first. First up we have the highlighter. This is sold separately. It's in the shade School is Fun. Super pretty. I'm wearing this on my cheeks today. It's a pearlized finished soft iridescent with a duochrome gold. So it's more on the sheer side but building it up you get this like duochrome of just gold on your cheeks and it's actually so beautiful and very unique. So that right there is School is Fun. Next up we have a blush and this is also sold separately. This is in Coin Purse and this is a matte finish, bright cool tone rosy pink. This is really pretty. I know it looks scary but you can actually wear this quite easily um, using like a stippling brush to just stipple it very gently on the cheek. You get a really pretty uh, wash of color. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Pretty wash of color. Focus. Excuse me. So that right there is coin purse. Next up we have Yummy Cookies and this is from the Hello Pretty collection. This color is a pearlized finish with a light peach of a little bit of silver in there. I think this color is so pretty. I think it looks nice on top of blushes as a blush topper. It's not quite intense like a highlight, but it does have that beautiful sheen to it. So that looks really pretty on top of any blush. And the last blush we have is also from the Hello Pretty collection. This is Fun With Friends. This is a pearlized finish, vivacious, mid-tone warm pink. This is really pretty. It's what I'm wearing on my cheeks today. Ooh la la, I really like that. It's kind of just like a very summery, bright, corally pink shade. Why is it not focusing? Hello! So this right here is Fun With Friends. So these are all the blushes and the highlighter. So the very first eyeshadow we have is called Juicy Apple. This is a glitter sheer finish, soft gold, with gold glitters all throughout. This is super pretty. I'm wearing this on my lids today. It's a very buildable glitter shade, meaning because it's sheer, you can add as much glitter as you want. And I love that you don't need a glitter base for this because it just stays on your eyes perfectly. And I just love these so, so much. Next up, we have Sticker Sheet. This is a satin finish, cool toned taupe. I love this color so much. I'm wearing it in my crease today. It's a beautiful transition shade as well. I really love it. And you guys know I love the matte ColourPop shadows. So that is sticker sheet right there. Next up we have Bento Box, which is a pearlized finished true gunmetal. This color is so pretty, very unique. I think it looks so cool. I don't think I have a shadow like this exactly. Look how pretty that is. Next up we have Rainbow, and this is a glitter sheer finish white with highlights of silver and pink glitter all throughout it. Again, another beautiful color. I hope this shows up on camera because these are really, really pretty. Look at that. Ow! All right, next up we have Friendship File. This is a metallic finish, warm peachy beige, dusted with silver and pink glitter. I love these like kind of more neutral, coppery tones because I love wearing these like every day. And this looks beautiful on the lid. Next up we have Small Gift, and this is a pearlized finish, mid-tone, peachy pink. This color is really pretty for like summer too because it's like a really pretty corally shade. I really, really like that as well. I could see that in the crease too. If you want to like warm up your crease, that would be really pretty. And the very last eyeshadow we have is called School Bus. And this is a pearlized finished deep navy blue. Really, really pretty color as well. They're all really pretty. I'm wearing this on my lids right now. 
So that's the color right there. So these are all of the eyeshadows. The first three are in the Hello Pretty collection, and the last four all come together in a quad called Mama's Apple Pie. Okay, so now moving on to the lips, and a majority of these colors are fuchsias, pinks, and reds. So I'm predicting some stainage, so bear with me. I'm gonna start off with the glosses first because I know those won't stain. So yeah, let's jump into it. First up, we have Super Cute. This is the Ultra Glossy Lip in a Sheer Finish. This is so pretty. It has like all these beautiful bright gold and fuchsia glitters all throughout. Like I can't stop staring at it. So this is a bright warm pink doused with pink glitter. Let's swatch it on the lips. I really wish my camera could pick up all the beautiful glitters in this lip gloss. In person, it's just so magical. Um, it has a lot of glitter in it, but it's not gritty at all. Super smooth, not sticky. I love the ColourPop lip glosses. So yeah, that is super cute, and it's super cute. Okay, next gloss we have is called KT. This is also in a sheer finish. It's a light gold with sprinkles of gold and pink glitter all throughout. It's really pretty. This is in the Hello Pretty collection. I forgot to mention Super Cute comes singly. So let's swatch KT. These glosses make your lips look so pretty because it has glitter in there as well it catches the light even more so it's like extra shiny and like extra juicy looking next up we have arigato domo arigato mr robato i don't know what that was but i really like that song um anyways this is in a sheer finish it's a hot pink with a lot of pink glitter and gold glitter in there too it's like oh they're just so pretty like they're magical okay i'm just gonna swatch it This is Arigato on the lips. Although it's sheer, it does have a really pretty wash of pink. I generally don't wear a lot of pink and red glosses, but this one's actually kind of cute to throw on like an everyday type of gloss. So yeah, let's move on to the last gloss. And the last gloss we have is in Trinkets, and this is also a sheer finish. It's a blue-based red, and it has a soft amount of sparkle. It's in there, but it's not as sparkly as the other three. So let's swatch Trinkets. So this is Trinkets on the lips. Obviously a sheer red gloss is usually going to come out more pink on the lips, but it would be pretty on top of any red or pink lipstick to just make it more glossy. So yeah, really pretty. Let's move on. Now I'm moving on to Ultra Satin Lips, and the very first one is in Tiny Chum. I love this color so much. I even talked about it in my October favorites. I've been wearing this a lot. It's definitely a just color. So, and I love that it's an Ultra Satin Lip because those are my favorite. So let's just swatch it. <laughs> Is this color not so pretty? I don't know. I just really like this color. It reminds me a lot of Dopey. When ColourPop first launched their Ultra Satin Lips, they had a color called Dopey, and that was like my all-time favorite for the longest time. But I think that got replaced by Tiny Chum. Just saying. Um, Dopey is a little bit more purple than this one. This is a little bit more dusty. So, yeah. I love this color so much. And the last Ultra Satin Lip we have is called Lock Diary, and it's a beautiful fuchsia shade. This is Lock Diary on the lips. I feel like on the lips it's a little bit warmer. Maybe it's just my eyes. Maybe. I don't. Maybe I need to get my eyes checked. I don't know. But either way, it's a really beautiful color. Let's move on. Next up, we have an ultra metallic lip, and it's in the color Surprise. This literally reminds me of the Wizard of Oz, like Dorothy's ruby red slippers. So pretty. It's a red with a lot of copper and hot pink glitters all throughout, and I love that. So let's swatch it on the lips. I think we're definitely off to see the wizard in this color. It's so pretty and it feels very festive. So I feel like this would be really cool during the holidays or Christmas time. Next up, we have an ultra matte lip and this is in the color Ribbon. It looks like the most perfect red ever. This comes in the Hello Pretty collection along with that gold gloss. So let's try on Ribbon. I 
was right. This is like the most perfect shade of red. It's so beautiful and it makes my lips look like they're made of velvet, which I love. Um, the formula is amazing. Super comfortable on the lips. It's not super dry. I really like this color and I don't want to take it off. Also because I know it's going to be a little bit hard to take off and I still have three more colors. Okay, so let's move on. And the last things I'm going to swatch are these three lippy sticks and all three of these have different formulas to them. I'm going to start off with Konnichiwa and this is in a creme finish. I love the creme finishes because they feel very hydrating on the lips. They have like a slight little sheen to them but really, really creamy and I love this and this color, you guys. Mmm, it's like your lips went better. I don't know, I think I'm going to really like this color. So let's swatch already. <laughs> This is Konnichiwa on the lips. I think it's a really pretty everyday shade, kind of like that cool tone, mauve pink color. I really like it, and I love, I love the way these feel on the lips. So yeah, that is Konnichiwa. Let's move on to the next one. This is Date Matte, and this is a matte X formula. I really like the matte X formulas because they are super matte, velvet looking, and opaque without drying out your lips like maybe a matte liquid lipstick would. So yeah, this is a beautiful hot pink shade like Barbie hot pink. So let's swatch it on the lips. So this is Date Matte on the lips. I love the way these feel. Oh, feels so good. All right, we have one more to go and we are done. So let's move on to the last one. We have Let's Play and this is in a satin luxe finish. It's a really pretty cranberry red shade and it has a lot of hot pink like pearly glitters all throughout and it's a really pretty color. So let's swatch this on the lips. So this is Let's Play on the lips. Again, I feel very festive and it does remind me of Surprise just a little bit. Um, but Surprise is more intense and has more of that metallic sheen to it. So if you like Surprise but you don't like ultra metallic lips for some reason and you want it in a lippy stick form, then I would go for this one. This is just a little bit less metallic, but you definitely get that sheen, that like hot pink glitter sheen without being like too disco ball. So yeah, kind of like Sisters. A little bit. So yeah, that was the very last product in this entire collection. So that was everything. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. It's a lot of fun to make. Let me know in the comments down below what your favorites were. And as usual, don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Makeup by Jessie. You can follow me on Snapchat, Jessie Jet. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. <laughs>